Tesla has been dethroned. BYD is so much ahead of Tesla in China, it's like a... It's just, it's almost ridiculous. Chinese automaker BYD surpassed Tesla as the new worldwide leader in fully electric vehicle sales. We'll see uh, a big race between BYD and Tesla in the next uh, three to four years. BYD, or Build Your Dreams, once a small startup with just 20 employees back in 1995, has evolved into an electric car giant. The world's largest EV maker is getting into humanoid robotics. Shenzhen-based BYD, which recently passed Tesla as the world's top seller of electric vehicles, is already investing heavily into humanoid robotics. The manufacturer already has humanoids collaborating with autonomous systems at its plants. Now, according to reports, the manufacturer is getting deeper into the rapidly expanding humanoid robotics market. Can BYD compete with Tesla as it races toward mass producing its Optimus humanoid robot? Let's take a look. BYD is reportedly building a new embodied intelligence research team to focus on developing advanced robotics. The company is actively recruiting masters and PhD grads from top universities around the world for the initiative. The team's focus will be making factories more efficient by automating tasks like assembly and inspections. BYD plans to invest 100 billion yuan, or nearly 14 billion USD, into advanced AI. If BYD aims to take on Tesla with its own humanoid, it has some big challenges. The automaker has catching up to do, as Tesla has been developing its Optimus robot since 2021. It's a priority project, and Elon Musk says it will one day become the company's top-selling product by far. I... I think, I think everyone in the world is going to want one, like literally everyone. I, th I think the ratio of humanoid robots to humans will, will probably be at least two to one, something like that. One to one for sure, so we're, we're, which means like somewhere on the order of 10 billion uh, humanoid robots. While Tesla already designs most of its robot components and systems in-house, BYD relies heavily on partnerships. Primarily seen as an automaker, BYD must overcome perceptions to be taken seriously as a robotics innovator. There are also plenty of advantages. With more than 30 factories worldwide, BYD's production scale eclipses Tesla's. Like Tesla, BYD is seen as a leader in factory automation, already proving it can effectively scale. A convergence of factors is pushing BYD to innovate faster. A growing labor shortage in China, intensified by the country's aging population, heightens the need for automation to meet demand. China's national push to dominate humanoid robotics by 2027 aligns with BYD's factory automation and robotics ambitions. With strong government support, BYD has access to funding, talent, and research collaborations to accelerate development. And BYD has already deployed humanoid robots in its facilities, such as this industrial robot from UbiTech. In this footage, Walker S1 robots collaborate with an autonomous tractor and vehicle as part of a full-stack logistics system. The robot's camera system delivers 360-degree safety monitoring, while its hands have special sensors to grip and hold items with just the right amount of force. UbiTech says the Walker S1's multitask execution capabilities position it as a leading humanoid for generalized industrial tasks. BYD is also a major investor in a Shanghai startup that's already mass-producing humanoids. Ajabot, which is also known as Xuan Robotics, shared footage of its manufacturing facility that's reportedly produced at least 962 humanoids. The company says the plant is the first mass production factory for humanoid robots in Shanghai. According to the paper, a state-run digital newspaper, around 200 are for internal use and around 700 have been shipped to customers. Production began in October 2024 and scaled in December. Ajibot boasts what it calls the largest embodied data collection facility with more than 100 robots operating together to collect real-world and simulation data. This generates millions of data points daily to improve robotic learning and adaptability. The facility includes simulated human spaces like bedrooms, living rooms, and bathrooms to prepare humanoid robots for domestic applications. 
Ajabot, which is backed by BYD, SAIC, and BAIC, has a reported value of 7 billion yens or 980 million in US dollars. The number of robots produced exceeds the target Ajabot announced in August 2024 when the company said it would produce 300 humanoids by the end of the year. Kang Ji Hui, a former Huawei youth genius who founded Ajabot, said at the time he believes the company can produce and sell robots at a lower cost than Tesla's Optimus. Elon Musk has said the Tesla bot could cost between 20 and 30,000 once production is scaled. He considers that a good deal for a robot that can perform virtually any task a human can do. The cost of products and services will decline dramatically and basically anyone will be able to have any products and services they, they want. It will be an age of abundance, the likes of which people have not, almost no one has envisioned. It'll be something special. Ajibo's flagship humanoid, the A2, stands about 1.7 meters or 5 feet 6 inches and has 40 degrees of freedom. It's equipped with sensors like cameras, LiDAR, and microphones to interact with dynamic environments. Its AI system for task execution reportedly understands user intent and perceives environments while executing tasks across multiple levels. The A2 performs tasks that require extreme precision, like threading a needle, as well as customer service and business consulting. The humanoid robot line also includes the Expedition, A2W, and A2 Max. The Expedition A2W, designed for flexible manufacturing, can carry up to 5 kilograms in each arm with 7 degrees of freedom. It's wheeled for swift movement in industrial settings. The Expedition A2 Max is a heavier-duty version of the robot that carries heavy objects and boasts 67 degrees of full-body freedom. Its legs exert up to 8,800 newtons of thrust, enough to lift a small car. Also, Shenzhen-based Pudu Robotics plans to unveil its new bipedal robot in a few days. The company says the robot is modeled in human form and infused with human wisdom. Pudu has an established presence with nearly 70,000 robots across 60 countries. Their robots are used in restaurants, retail, hospitality, and healthcare. In September 2024, the company revealed its Pudu D7 a so-called semi-humanoid robot that can ride elevators on its own. With its human-like upper body, the AI robot moves in all directions with its omnidirectional chassis. Pudu also recently announced its DH-11 robot hand with 11 degrees of freedom. The hand includes extensive touch coverage with 12 tactile sensors with more than a thousand pixels for precise positioning and force manipulation. To find out more about Kudu's bipedal robot and other upcoming humanoid advancements, make sure to subscribe.